Hi guys and welcome to 2019, our first market wrap of the year. Today we're down at 1 at 30 to 32 Dare Street. This property will be going to auction on the 16th of February. Uh, we've had a fantastic campaign down here. We've run two open homes and we've had over 30 people through so far. So a really great start to the 2019 auction market. We've seen some funny numbers happening this year, Peter, across the board. Uh, at the end of 2018, we saw the market slow down a little bit. Um, mm. Probably be, you know, basically yep. the Melbourne market slowing down. It takes a few months to hit Ocean Grove, Barwon Heads and the Ballerine Peninsula. Yep. But we are starting to see our numbers really take off. Um, coming into the tail end of January, we've mm. had over 11 sales for the, for the company in total. So it's been showing some really good signs of improving. Yeah, and look, we've probably seen exactly the same, Toby, in Barring Heads and Connawarri. The first two weeks of January were fairly quiet um, through inspections and inquiry. But the last two weeks have really kicked off. Um, we've got seven properties that have gone under contract um, in the last two weeks alone, which is great. And notably of that, our buyer demographic are both investors and homeowner buyers, which really supports what we've been saying about there is buyer confidence in our markets down here which is really good news for those thinking of selling. Um, in Bowen Heads alone at the moment, there is seven homes available to buy that you could move into today, and only two of those are under a million dollars. So the market's, yeah, good. And look, that's it. With the last two weeks of January, everyone's going back to school, and yeah. the, the buyers do really start to come out after the school holidays. They're yeah. all relaxed and having yeah. a good time. So yeah, we're seeing some great numbers. And Peter, tell us about some of the fantastic results you've had in Bowen Heads over the last sort of month or so. Yeah, so one of the great results that we've had coming out of January was 32B Wattlebird. Um, on the market for 17 days, 18 inspections and selling for 965,000. It was a huge response, um, yeah, and a great result for the location. What about you, Toby? Yeah, Grove? We, we, look, we've had some up and down results. We had a fantastic result down at 28 Wilton's Road. Uh, that property was on the market for about four, eight days, nine yep. days. Um, Trent wrapped up just over a million dollars. Really big family, solid home um, with some local buyers. So that was a fantastic result. We've also brought some amazing properties to market in January in the highly desirable location of Margate Street. Number 52 to 54 is a sprawling family home set on an enormous allotment of 974 square metres. And we are also set to launch Eight River Parade, fabulous two-storey family home with the river on your doorstep, uninterrupted views, generous 885 square metre block, great size. We're running an Expressions of Interest campaign there and that will be closing on the 4th of April. So some great properties coming to market. What about the Grove, Toby? Yeah, 99 Power Street's a fantastic new development that's getting built just near the old football oval there, right in the heart of town, four yep. bedroom, really highly spec build. Yep. So that's really exciting. That's just gone live online. Another property that we've just launched on Friday was Five the Parade, two storey home, nice big 800 square metre block yep. with sensational views of the river and also across to the bluff and the ocean. So two really exciting properties hitting the market this year. So I guess it was a slow start to 2019, but the momentum has certainly kicked off. Um, here's to a fantastic 2019 um, and hope the momentum rolls right through across our markets. See you next month.